Hello, this is Presh Tulliker. In a previous video, I showed you how you can do the times table from 6 through 10 on your fingers. In this video, I'll explain why this works. The method begins by numbering the fingers on your hands 6 through 10. To do 7 times 8, we line up the finger for 7 on the left hand with the finger for 8 on the right hand. We then count the number of fingers, including the fingers which are touching, that are below the fingers which are touching. There were five fingers in this figure. These are the tens units, so this becomes 50. On the left hand, there are three fingers above the touching fingers, and on the right hand, there are two fingers above the fingers touching. We multiply three and two to get six, and that gets us our answer of 56. But why does this method work? I'll try and explain the problem in another way. Let's try and do 10 minus 3 times 10 minus 2. This is the same problem of 7 times 8, but we'll think about it as 10 minus 3 times 10 minus 2. On the left hand, we rotate three fingers from the pinky, and on the right hand, we line up two fingers from the pinky. We then count the number of fingers which are below the fingers that are touching. This is 10 minus 3 on the left hand, and then we subtract 2 for the fingers that are above the touching fingers on the right hand. So what we're doing here is 10 times 10 minus 3 minus 2, which is 50. Now we count the number of fingers which are above the touching fingers. There's 3 on the left and 2 on the right. We then multiply these to get 6. And that, once again, gives us 56. So now you can see why the process works in general. We'll think about it algebraically. What we're really doing is we're multiplying 10 minus A times 10 minus B, where A is the number of fingers above the touching fingers, or from the pinky, and B is the same quantity on the right hand. The two fingers which we're touching, we label as 10 minus A and 10 minus B. Now, how many fingers are below the touching fingers? Well, we subtract A fingers on the left and B fingers on the right from 10 in total. So this becomes 10 times 10 minus A minus B. We then multiply the A and B fingers which are above to get AB. And this is why the reason works. We're essentially doing the FOIL method of 10 minus A times 10 minus B, but using our fingers in a concrete method. So it's totally valid technique and it's pretty cool that it works. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe to my channel. You can get my books. There's a link in the video description. You can catch me on my blog, Mind Your Decisions, which you can follow on Facebook, Google Plus, and Patreon. And you can also catch me at Presh Talwalker on a bunch of social media sites.